Good morning, it's very early, it's about 20 past 5 on Saturday the 30th of July. We're on our way back. Uh, getting a tra got a train booked this morning from Plymouth to Birmingham New Street and then Birmingham New Street down to Rugby. Um, the train leaves at 25 past 7 this morning. Uh, we've got a lot to carry because we weren't planning on going back on the train. We were going to go back with uh, Nikki's mum and dad. Uh, but they have commitments now as we've stayed a lot longer. So we've got to squeeze it all and carry it all and get it all on the train. So this should be fun. But yeah, it's going to be good to be back. Three and a half hours here to rugby and then we've got to get another train from rugby to oh, no Birmingham. we've got three and a half hours from here to Birmingham and then we've got to get another train from Birmingham down to rugby but we're on our way should be on this platform in about 15 minutes. This train station is huge, it's about two or three levels. We've been um, stairs, lift and all sorts. Very, very busy, but it's a relief uh, that the trains are running at least. There's a, a national train strike here in the UK today, uh, so we have been delayed an hour, uh, but that's all, so it's not too much really. I'll just be glad to see Chugs again. Um, our lovely friend Stuart is picking us up from a rugby train station. So that'll be nice, and thank you very much, Stuart. Uh, oh, can't wait to see Jugs again. Another train. Yeah, last train. We should be leaving here, I don't know, in about half an hour, 40 minutes. It's about an hour then, uh, down to rugby. It's been a long morning. I can't tell you how good it feels to see Chugs again. Well, that's it. We're all at Yelvertoft. We're all back on Chugs. I'm going to say we're all. I mean, we're all on Chugs. We picked Chip up before 
a big thank you to our friend Stuart who picked us up from Rugby train station and also took me to Daventry to Vets for Pets to pick little Chip up so he's back on board so that's nice uh, yeah we've had a lovely break in Cornwall but it does feel so good to be back on the boat uh, Pete and Val, Nick, his mum and dad made us very, very welcome. Thank you so much, you two, if you're watching this. We've had a lovely time. Really enjoyed Cornwall. Saw parts of Cornwall I never, never knew existed. Hadn't been there only once or twice in the past anyway. But uh, really, really enjoyed it in their beautiful new home. It's gorgeous. Uh, that was good. It was lovely to do the schooling as well. Homeschooling, believe it or not, with the kids. We did so many different things and... I downloaded an app where you could identify flowers and plants and weeds and all sorts. So we did like little exercises with that. The kids would go take pictures. We'd find out the Latin names and they would do like a, a folder and a portfolio, if you like. Um, so that was nice to get out and do stuff like that. And of course, we can continue doing that when we're on chugs after the school holidays. They're on holidays at the moment. Uh, I remember lovely walks with Nikki used to go out in the evening and have little walks uh, down little lanes and have a chat. It was just gorgeous and we were blessed with some lovely weather at times as well. It was really nice. Memories of Cornwall got to be the old pumping houses that they had for the tin and iron mines down there and of course clay mines down there. But the fantastic architecture and history down there. It's phenomenal. Uh, beautiful, uh, breathtaking, in fact. And you see some unusual things, like this English electric lightning that was standing proud outside of car sales down there when we were out one day. And in fact, my old friend Dave has actually fueled that aircraft up a few times. I think it would have been at Brimbrook, RAF Brimbrook there on the East Coast. But yeah, it was nice. Uh, unfortunately, now uh, is the job of unpacking. Got lots of unpacking and sorting out to do. I've already been cleaning a little bit in the well deck. Nicky's been cleaning the boat. It was uh, Spider Central. There was a few spiders in there, but uh, they've all gone now. So we've just got to unpack and put stuff away and we've got to blitz the boat. Um, we do have plans for Monday. Today is Saturday. We do have plans for Monday and those will come clear in a future vlog. Uh, apologies, no vlog for Saturday, today. Um, we simply didn't do anything on that last week. So I'm not just going to film stuff, just for the sake of putting a vlog out. But uh, we're back on the boat now, so normal service should resume, I think. But we're, fo we're feeling pretty recharged. Sorry about the wind noise, folks. It's a bit of a breeze here. Ooh. We're feeling pretty... Let's get behind this tree. Get out the wind if I can. Feeling pretty recharged. Uh, we're tired today. Obviously, it's been a long trip, and of course, for the kids and the, and the doggies as well. Um, but felt so good to see Chugs again. I feel at home again. It's uh, It's been good, but you can't beat your home, can you? And uh, my home is Chugs. My home is the cat. And I've missed it. I can't deny it. I've enjoyed myself. We all have. But I'm looking forward to getting that engine going and we'll go cruising again. Well, it started to rain. I think Nikki's cooking garlic mushrooms tonight, so happy days. See you soon.